Hey guys, welcome back to some more Street Fighter 6. I'm not entirely too sure how much we have left. I know Robert said there are 15 chapters or so. He didn't spoil it for me, but he just told me how many chapters. Uh, he did say that he'd be good in about two weeks. So here's hoping that he'll be back soon so we can finish Resident Evil and then we can do whatever it is we need to do afterwards. The informant said you needed to be wearing a certain something, right? You haven't messed with that outfit, I hope. Oh. Uh, I have to equip it. Oh, but I, I have such a good thing set up here. You sons of... Okay. Okay. What was it? The coat. <laughs> and a big ass TV on my head. Hell yeah, let's do it. All right, is this good enough, you jag off? <laughs> sure, you're wearing a lab coat. I'm not changing my appearance. It looks like some fucking nerd. Head down to the Grace Marina, just uh, just like that. Follow the instructions you receive after. <laughs> Godspeed, researcher. So I've been seeing. Okay, hold on. Sorry, <laughs> I, just, I went to the side to look at OBS. I've been seeing a lot of people complain about um the Flash movie. I mean, let's put aside the fact that um. Urza Miller is a uh, Raimi lunatic who by far is, I would say he's the best actor because he hit it so well and there's just, I don't know, I think he just did a good job of hiding how crazy he was. I don't know if there's a movie where he played crazy, but he can do it. You know, just gotta be himself. Uh, they used a lot of CGI. They used Ted, Ted Sears, I think is his name. Uh, he's from the Flash TV show. He played, uh, well, he played, and spoilers for The Flash, uh, season two, if you guys haven't seen it already. Alright, just, you know, heads up, uh, spoilers. Um, Teddy Sears plays, uh, Jay Garrick in The Flash TV series. However, he's not Jay Garrick, he's, uh, he's known as, uh, Hunter Zolomon, aka he's Zoom. Uh, the real Jay Garrick is played by an older uh, John Wesley Sh Snipes? Ships? The old actor for the original or one of the older Flashes. And he was like, oh, fuck. I didn't know I was in this movie. You know, he's that John Tron bit where he's like, man, I was really good in this movie. I don't remember being. So. And then they had Nick this cage in there. It's Nutburgers. What if I fight your dad? I'm assuming he's your dad. I don't know. He's just a random stranger. Hey, Curtis. I'm gonna fight real quick. Because I... Forgot that. I forgot X wasn't to talk to them. I was playing Far... Uh, not Far Cry. I was playing another game that required me to hit. Um, another button. I got confused. Hmm. Hey, I need to talk to you. Are you the maintenance worker for Siren? He just, <laughs> he just has like a busted lip and a black eye. Name's Curtis. I'm an officer stationed on the aircraft carrier Byron Taylor. We've got maintenance scheduled today for the cleaning bots we're testing on the ship. All set and ready to go. Well. Hmm. All right, then. Allow me to welcome you aboard. The aircraft carrier Byron Taylor. I suck at reading. Mm. Sorry that, that was a cutscene. So you might have heard we've been having some issues with maintenance 
Reality is, the damn Clooney bots around here have become a science fiction nightmare. They're basically rampaging across the entire flight deck. Have I got to find a damn fridge again? We're going to have words later. Set that one prank call where they tell you is your refrigerator running. Yeah, it's running a muck, causing a whole entire just the whole bad situation. Think you might be able to put a stop to them, maybe even bring them in for a retrieval? Come on, you 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 uh Oh, I've had the spinning bird kick. I oh, not the spinning bird kick with the the spiral arrow. Spam that real quick. Come on. Yeah, that'll learn you. Protocol. The deck must be spotless at all times. Plus, my men are due back any time. Back in the day. I used to call Gallo Guile just because I didn't know how to pronounce it. I don't know. That's just, I don't know. <laughs> just call him Guile. Oh, he is level 30. Hang on, real quick. We're going to fight him. Time my nose gets the stuffiest. All right, now get your ass up. I want to see what you got. Like, like w what your wares situation is looking like. What can I get for you? Uh, crap. Ooh, they have that cool helmet. Like John Rambo kind of character. All right, we let us talk. Hey. I suppose this thing is your responsibility. Something like that. I see. 
A robot that's meant to clean the flight deck, huh? Don't seem to be much good at it. Yeah, well, I mean, you split it in half. I mean, hypothetically speaking, I was supposed to fix it. Well, now I can't anymore. Hey, no need to apologize to me. <laughs> I'm Gaio, Air Force. I always thought Gaio was millet like, army. He he dressed it, like, in the colors for it. Then again, I don't know. I just That was my assumption. I've been stationed here for a while as a training advisor. You know, I thought I recognized you from somewhere. You fought in Metro City's Novice League, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, sir. And won. That explains that. You're a fellow fighter. In that case, the next time we talk, it may be with our fists. Successfully established contact. Let's see a photo. Mr. Gaio, I gotta take a photo of you real quick. Wrong one. Uh. What do you think, guys? Not the most flattering. Look at look at that guy. Look at those low poly motherfucker in the background. Like, oh yeah, look, listen. This is the Xbox Series S. I, I can cut some slack, but you can tell where most of the budget went. Alright. Okay, cool. Let's see. Look at Shark. Colonel Guile. Pride of the USA Air Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> uh, I guess that would mean he's stationed aboard the aircraft carrier Byron Taylor. Okay then. That's another valuable piece of intel pile. I'll message you with any new info I find on Bosch as soon as I lock it down. I told you he's from Na Nashal, right? I traveled to Nashal. Locked in. Oh, no, sorry. Fucking... Rah! Why can't I read? Damn it. I'm good at reading to myself. I think... I, I, I've got to travel route to Nashal locked in. So, for now, how about paying a visit in person and seeing the place for yourself? Hey, Mateo. Fight me real quick. Yeah, got to prove something. Uh, I would. Uh, I'm not really good with Guile's fighting style, so. Also, I learned that. Oh, bullshit. Is it Tatsumaki Sapuki or Tatsumaki Sapukuyaku? Hey Curtis. Well. Man, it's all done. Ready to head back to Metro City? Uh -huh. Absolutely. Cause I need to buy a few things before I get my asshole fisted real quick. Urgent. Oh god. A uh, good day it is I. Uh, oh, sorry. I'm saying this uh, from Life Ends Device. This is Lao Tang, Chun Li's student. There's something I would like to discuss. Can you come to Chinatown? Why do you have Life in Life Ends uh, phone? Questions are being raised. I have so many things I need to do right now. We'll go check out the other place that guy was talking about. We'll do that real quick before we continue with the story. So we're just gonna go do that real quick. Let's see. How are you looking at? 
You default looking motherfucker. Thank you so much. These are so expensive. Also, when the fuck did I get that much money? Okay. So, let's head to the world map. Okay. Wait a minute, why does that sound familiar? Oh wait, the arcade mode. All right, all we had to do was just finish, just, uh, come here real quick. Yo, where you at? Huh? So that's where you are. I suppose have told me all about that place. All kinds of wild stuff going there. Anywho, I've got a verse from the food to gossip to lay on you. It's all about clothes, dog. So you know, Joe, you bomb. When I'm fine to now. You got a mountain of threads sitting around. If you bring them to a shop, you got two options: a sell them or a handsome. Selling well is just that you can trade in the old clothes for cash. But get this, Hansy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know about Hansy. You're a little late on that. I don't remember ever signing out. Yes, I, I told you you can use my. Thing one time and you do not leave me alone. Oh wait, this is different. This is more like This is more uh like actually explorable. It's not like just one little set place. I start fighting everybody. Yeah, we can actually fully explore this. Oh, fuck, Retsu. Oh, he's gonna kick my ass now. He's probably stronger. Alright, that's <laughs> Alright, if I beat you, I get a deal. Right in the nuts. Get your ass up. I want to buy you some wares from you and help you establish your economy here. Welcome. Ah. Oh, you sell food. Okay. 
Oh, those look so good, but I'm pretty sure that would mess up my insides. Yeah, this has like a full marketplace and everything here. All right, that's Retsu right there. Who's over here? Ah, oh, my nuts! Ah, oh, you fucks. That's why you better run, you fucking pussy! I do legit rage quit. Oh crap. Alright, this is gonna be a. Man, they're gonna be on my ass, guys. I need to make this real quick, cause I'm gonna be just gonna be like that the park at night. Stop right there! Ah, oh, shit. Yeah. Nice, better than nice. You're downright perfect. By which I mean, you look strong and unlikely to turn down a request from a random stranger on the street. This was a mistake, guys. I apologize. That we'll go a little bit longer today, which is to say, mind helping me out with my job? I'll pay you, of course. Uh. Uh, on a piecework basis, match. It's a photo assignment for a magazine. The area is a little rough. Uh, let's say there's a river. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 You want me to take photos for you because you're too much of a candy ass to to fight anybody around here. All right. Whatever. What? Hey, what the? All oh, right. The the fight challenges. Excuse, excuse me, excuse you. What the hell? You're strong, aren't you? <laughs> All you need is one. Little, little, little. Come on, let's play. That's right, the the challenger thing. Shit, guys, I might lose this. Hey guys, I'm doing no damage. Shit. Oh, this is gonna suck. I still got another round of this. God damn. Okay. Damn, that did nothing.
shit. We'll probably have to take the L on this one, guys. Got a little too cocky. Then why would I eat that? Sorry guys, I know I'm quiet, but I'm like super focused. I want to try these beater once. Damage output is nearly enough to. You now, what was naive is challenging her. I thought I was hot shit because I was just like a higher level than her. Alright. She's gonna do a attack.
Okay, sorry guys, a loud ass truck came in. I don't know, I, just, I, I don't know. I, a part of me just needed a, a second to think. That was hard. <sighs> nice work. Shut up. Give me a break. <laughs> no, please just, just, just leave me a holy shit. Not entirely too sure what we could have done in that situation that would have made us any stronger. Alright, cool. We'll get that one real quick, so. Damn, there are a lot of people here. Are, oh my god, look how jacked that dude is. Maybe the, look at that guy, he's 45. Fuck that, I'm not afraid of him. At least not yet, I'll probably wait till later. Alright guys, uh, well we wasted enough time, so. Let's go ahead and... Mm. Let's go back. Let's go back to our, our safe space in the USA. Also, don't forget we gotta we gotta go talk to uh, to Ken right after. Are you? Oh, you gotta sh be shitting on my nutsack. Hold on, let's go see who this Jagamo is up here. Alright, let's just see what level he is. Those other guys are like level fucking 100 and shit. Hello! Andor Jr. Crap. Alright, I'll probably come back when I'm fully upgraded and stuff, because... Although I won, I needed, I needed a lot of help. Like, a lot of assistance, so... Plus, I don't want to... I don't bore you guys with that, so. Also, I believe that guy is from, like, an older Street Fighter back when, like, before it was Hugo. <laughs> Goodness, thank you for coming. <laughs> yeah, what's up? What I want to discuss? Well, uh, as it turns out, life ends got missing. Oh, it's something get worked uh, into a tizzy over. She's always doing this sort of thing. Just ups up and runs off somewhere. Y'all think is she didn't take any of her portable gizmos this time. You wouldn't happen to know anything, would you? No, I don't, but I'm gonna find out. <laughs> Charlie, 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 says help. What? You wonder where life end might have run off to? She's usually f fiddling with her computer around here or grabbing dim sum. Most recently, she's been ordering uh, Shaboyan nonstop from that Bao Bao Bro guy. Uh, <laughs> Oh no, wait, wrong way. Ah! 
<laughs> I did work myself up to a dizzy. You! Do you have any answers? What's up? Life end? Now that you mention it, I haven't seen her in the shop at all. We're still getting her orders though. Shabo and extra meat. The only the only one who order that is Life End. Bow Bow Bro handles deliveries. Maybe you could try nabbing him and asking him yourself. If I gotta beat his ass real quick. What is it? So help me God. Where does Bow Bow Bro usually make deliveries, you ask? Late night demand over in the Eastern Business District has been booming lately. You're about to bump into each other around that area at night. Yeah! Okay, we gotta go guys, we gotta go. Life ends, she, she needs us. If something bad happens to her, I'm about to whip everyone's ass. Everybody's getting ass whoopings. Okay. Life end. Here's more info on Bosch. After stealing the cash from Madagear, he flew to England. He was planning to meet up in the shop. As well as, uh, you were there. Uh, well, it's still my thunder, but it, but you after uh, we don't have it after. How do I? But I uh, but come hell or high water, I'm gonna find out. I'll message you later. Okay, cool. Why don't you file that on this shit that I already? Oh my God, he's on the run! Bow, bow, you piece of shit, come back here. Mr. Guy, Mr. You fuck hold still. Where is she? Tell me. I have to try harder than that asshole. Alright, you sperm looking bastard. Tell me what you know. No! Fuck the round two! Dragon! <laughs> Although they're not together anymore, you guys should definitely check out uh, Friday Night Fisticuffs by the Super Best Friends. It's really entertaining. Yeah. Alright, you bastard. Huh? Shaboy, extra meat. Oh yeah, this one girl orders that stuff around the clock. I delivered an order like that just recently, come to think of it. It came in at night. As far as locations go, it was at the office for this scrapyard on the west side of town by the ocean. Uh, you want this costume so you can infiltrate their office? It's soaked and sweat, but hey, if you're cool with the salty sun, knock yourself out. <sighs> okay. Alrighty. Where are we at time-wise? Okay, I think we could uh, squeeze it. All right. Status. Bow bow hat. What else did we get that it's causing us to? Yeah. 
I was gonna buy something, but I forgot he doesn't sell the. Uh, still like this Jagamo copy of me. Fuck ass. Get your own style! Oh, so lately I've been getting like scam phone calls and calls about some other stuff. I don't know. Uh, probably because I owe some money to the hospital and I haven't paid it back yet. <laughs> Anyways, so, uh, and a bunch of police that took loans out. Uh, there, there's like this, they, every time they call, I answer with, um, a random ass thing. So I'll be like, <clears throat> let me do it for you real quick. Okay, so you guys know how I normally sound. Uh, but when I answer the phones, a number I don't recognize, I answer as Adam. So here's how I do that. I go. Thank you for calling Electric Sheet Console and Computer Repair. This is Adam. How can I help you? Oh, you're looking for Justin? Um, let me just check to see if we have anybody here by that name. You know, and I'm in I'm in the IT room, so I just do a little clickety clack on my on the computer. Uh, I'm sorry. It seems that there's nobody here by that name. Are you sure you got the right number? Oh, this is the number written down. Well, I hate to tell you this, but this is the number we recently acquired for our new phones that we have here in the the shop that. Recently was just set up by our boss. So if any other outward calls there that that he would know But unfortunately, he's not in right now. So I mean, I'm truly sorry about that. I, I Hope you guys managed to get him However, you can oh, No, thank you. You have a good day, sir. And I just you know, I just do it like that <laughs> Um, Yeah, so <laughs> That's what I've been doing Hey, you fucks Maggers, uh, Maggers operating here right now. If you're not supposed to be here, so go about that. Sheesh. Oh, what's holding the delivery guy? I am wearing it. You guys saw that, right? I'm wearing it. Oh, I'm not wearing it. Hey, it's me again. Whoa, it's Bow Bow Bro. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's me. Uh, another day, another delivery, eh? Far be it from me to stop you from doing your job. If she's secretly a bad guy, I'm gonna be very upset. My fan. What is it? Bow bow, bro. Huh? I don't remember making an order. No way. Wait, Jubert. Don't, don't, don't ignore where that came from. <laughs> wow, you really came to my rescue, didn't you? Listen, just getting this out of the way up front, but I'm totally fine, really. Uh, well. Some Mad Gear goons brought me here, and get this. Apparently, they wanted to know what was on that data card, too. They have zero chance of cracking the encryption on that thing without me, so... Oh, please don't tell me you gave it to them. Plus, you know, I'm already sort of used to being kidnapped. Anyway, let's blow this joint. At first, I was all pumped, like, whoa, surprise shabbling. But honestly, knowing it was you made me even more pumped. Yeah, okay, hang on, take it easy. I've uh, actually been kidnapped before, believe it or not. Uh, the first time I met uh, Big Sister was when she came to my rescue. Oh, life in. All right, let's go. Come on, let's get you out of here. Pretty sure we're going to have to fight people for this. What the fuck? Actually, I don't know why I'm surprised about this happening. The dude is a scumbag. And he has been the boss, or like the first boss from like Final Fight stuff. Bro, we life, hey, we got this. What the shit? Oh, 
Fuck yeah, you little wizard. Not bad, yo. But I got a trump card. I'm not I don't know why I'm surprised. I fought a fridge. Alright, let's kick some ass. Oh yeah, I could do that too. Well, at least I'm not getting my ass kicked this time. <laughs> you knocked that shit off right now. Did I catch him? Yes. I got sunglasses. Like, give me your fucking sunglasses. Damn it! Figured I took this kid hostage. I can twist your arm into doing another job for me. I was wrong about you, though. I gotta say, Jubert. You've really toughened up. Am I right? Imagine if I had two or three tough lungs like you fighting for me. Mad Gear would run this city just like old times. Can you imagine it? Cause I sure can. No way, man. I'm I'm going I'm I'm good. It sounds like a lot of work to be honest. Hey, quit scowling before you pop a vein. This is just my instincts talking, but trust me, you'll be back. The things we're searching for, you and me, they ain't so different. Yeah, whatever. Eat my ass. Yeah, you don't, you don't need that in your life. Oh, shit. All right, fuck, it's hot today. All right. Okay, so we went a little extra long today, so because I just kept getting into fights. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I hope everyone's having a good day, staying safe and healthy. And we'll see you guys next mission. Bye. Hi, this is Adam calling to you about your car's extended warranty. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Bye. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe.